Oh, here we go again. <coughs> okay. All this machined out really well, to be honest. You know when you say it's alright, but in the back of your mind you're not sure. What I did, before I turned this, I took this off and I took some more measurements. And it was the taper, I'd got it just a tad too tight, so I put the four jaw back on, reset it all up, trammed it in, uh, and I just took the finest of cuts and then it popped on a lot better. I put the dial gauge on it, uh, DTI gauge on it, and run it round, and well, you just have to take my word for it, the needle was hardly flickering when it was running in the middle. So, anyway, all that bit's done. This is now machined down to 40 mil. It's an M40 by 1.5. I've just done a scratch test. Although I had the lathe in the wrong gear, that's why there's too many lines, but I'm gonna put a 1.5 pitch on it. That fits the treat. So, get this threaded. And then what we've got to do is cut the taper. See, that's just following nicely. It's an imperial lathe, so I can't disengage the, the half nuts. Put a cut on. God, this seems weird. Not being able to uh, disengage. And this steel, boy, got it in hard. What I'm doing is uh, whatever cut I'm putting on the cross slide, I'm putting half on the top slide because the top slide's set 90 degrees to it, to the cross slide. That's how I do it anyway. Very deep thread this. That was at the same depth. So will this one.
I've got to say. I'm very careful on my load because of the drive dog that holds the leads for him. It decides to jump out when it feels like it. So I've got a piece of I've got it marked with some paint so <coughs> excuse me. So if it does come out I can uh, get back into the same spot. So I'm not going to go too much, just take my time. It's better if you put a cut on it, fella. Machine. This is the first thing I wanted to learn how to do. I don't know why. Spring pass. Same another spring pod. Try the nut in it. Let's put a shampoo on that front edge. <coughs> and on here. Just to make it look a bit better. Find that. One more pass of that. Please work. Right. The only thing we're doing something like this, you put so much work into it. If you go balls the thread up, it's all that work down the drain for nothing. You know, there's no slop in that. That's just right. 
can still want it. Right, so I'm going to show for that front edge and then I'm going to put a pot mark in here so I know which way this goes on. And then we've got to cut the taper and then it'll be finished. Right, see you in a bit. 